A second Qatari bid for Manchester United is set to be made amid growing confidence the Glazer family are willing to sell the club. Qatari Islamic Bank Chairman Sheikh Jassim bin Hamad bin Jassim bin Jaber Al Thani and Ineos CEO and Britain's richest man Sir Jim Ratcliffe are the two favourites to buy the Red Devils. Representatives from both parties recently visited the club in what was a concrete showing of interest in United. United were put up for sale by the Glazer family in November with several reports also claiming the American owners were looking for offers of around £4 billion to sell the club. And a potential deal may have moved one step closer as another bid from the Middle East is expected to come in imminently. Reports from Sky Sports understand Sheikh Jassim had told his advisers to start preparing a new bid for the 20-time Premier League winners. It is also understood a new offer will be tabled within the next 36 hours. There is even more confidence from potential bidders that the Glazers are willing to sell the club. They bought their first shares in the club in 2003, but took full control of the club in 2005, financing the £790 million purchase primarily through loans secured against assets of the club. But their premiership at the club could soon come to an end as Sheikh Jassim is extremely keen on a complete takeover. Sky Sports also claimed the Qatari Supremo is willing to overpay in order to win the auction. His representatives were also seen visiting the club on Thursday, only for Ratcliffe and his associates to arrange their own meeting 24 hours later. A U.S. insider said, all the numbers people from the bidders will be working out the real value of the club over the next few days. They will be making second bids. The reality is their first bids were just indicative. In this process, the second bids next week are really the first serious bids. Sheikh Jassim is part of the Qatari royal family which boasts an eye-popping combined net worth understood to be in the region of £275 billion. Ratcliffe, 70, boasts his own £20 billion wealth as the CEO of Ineos Group Limited, who also own League One giants Nice. However, as reported by The Sun, the possibility of the Glazers retaining their ownership of the club and instead joining forces with a huge investor is not off the table just yet.